Hi, my name is Dr. Angela Kerubo and I'm here to talk about work addiction. Work addiction, as most of us tend to think, is about working long hours, which is not the case. So work addiction is basically the compulsion or the uncontrollable need to keep working. So a workaholic always finds themselves guilty or anxious when they are not at work. So how do you know that you're a workaholic? So you can ask yourself a few basic questions. Are you always feeling the pressure to be at work, even when you're on holiday, or you don't have time to go on annual leave, or you feel anxious when you're away from work and you don't know what is happening? You find it hard to give like tasks and to delegate your job to others. When you're at home, you always carry home work from the office. You always have no time for lunch or tea break, and if you have to have lunch, you're seated at the desk and you take, take away lunch or tea and sometimes you find that you always have one more email, one more phone call that you need to make. There's always that trip over the weekend to the office that cannot wait for Monday. So more often than not, if you're finding yourself answering yes to more of these questions, then you know you're a workaholic. A workaholic or work addiction is a mental condition like any other condition like workaholism and is when you find yourself in such a situation, you can reach out for help. It will have an effect on your work itself, where your performance at the end, in the long term will go down as much as you may have better career perspectives. Again, you will find that you are more stressed, so you're not able to work well. Family, when it comes to family, you'll find that there is marital disaffection, so you no longer have time for your spouse and your children. You have no time for leisure with them. Again, you also find that there's more conflict at home because of your work. And then again, as an individual, there'll be physical, emotional, and both mental effects on your health. So sometimes you'll find you have that headache that does not go away. You just feel stressed, you feel tired, and you're not sick. You will have burnout, and at the end of the day, this will impact negatively, even on your life as an individual. So what do we do or what is the solution? The solution is you can reach out to a psychologist or a health practitioner who can help you with the problem. Number two, you can purpose to make changes in your life, physical changes like exercise more, avoid the things that stress you, and uh, take time out with your family, take time on holiday, and with this you'll find that your life is more balanced together with your work. Above all, get to rest. God in his wisdom rested on the seventh day and he urged us that we may also rest. So take time to rest and you will see a change in your life. Thank you.